Hello. Merry Christmas Eve. Um, so I am off today because I'm um, preparing for Christmas Eve. Just a couple of family members coming over. Um, we're having uh, meatballs. We're having some sausage sandwiches. And I've got a few other things that I'm throwing together. So um, I thought, hey, why not? uh vlog this a little i don't know why but whatever so that's what we're gonna do i did warn you guys that there would be some uh little home vlogs going on so i wasn't sure how many but um anyway this is the second home vlog the last one was a little insane if you haven't seen that you might want to go check that out because we yeah. were kind of crazy yes you do and there's polly <laughs> you want to say hello hi guys you want to say Happy Christmas Eve? Happy Christmas Eve, everyone! Okay, so I started my meatballs. I need to stir them. Um, I put them in around, I don't remember, about 9 o'clock. And it is 12 now. I like to let my meatballs go for about 6 hours. But I do need to get those stirred. So I'm going to do that. And then I haven't decided if I'm going to make my muffins first or um my ambrosia salad first so i don't know i gotta decide and make something happen it is time to brown up this beef i am making something called taco soup um i don't know you know how many people have heard of it i've only heard of it just in the past few years um but Dan loves it, and I've never made it before. Okay, so the beef is now browned, and I'm going to add the taco seasoning. And then I'm going to get my other ingredients out to start tossing in here. And I'll show you kind of as I go along, probably not step by step, but I'll show it to you. Okay, so I wasn't following any specific recipe for this. Um, I just sort of winged it based on, you know, what I know of taco soup and it's going to be more of a taco stew than a soup um because i want i bought chips like to use it kind of as a dip but it's going to be hot so i don't know we'll see um so of course it's it's ground beef with corn black beans i threw a jar of salsa in there um i put another taco seasoning packet in and i did um a packet of taco sauce so i don't i might need i oh no i'm sorry i did two cans of corn one of the black beans i forgot to show you guys us making our pepperoni roll bread thing so but there it is in the oven 40 minutes it'll come out taco soup so is really good. and the taco soup is doing amazing it's really good. Dan, you have taste tested it. I hear you over there talking about how great it's it is. It's really good. Yeah. We are so entertaining today. <gasps> okay. That's all I have. So, um... I'll be right back. Yeah, let's take a look at this pepperoni roll. It has not been, um... It has not been 40 minutes yet. It's only been, uh... Like 30 so it it looks darker on camera than it actually is that this part right here is a touch burnt but this is not as dark as it appears on camera honestly no it's um, not. i mean it's not bad i guess once we cut it open later we'll we'll see if it turned out well so i started cutting the pepperoni roll and it actually looks pretty darn good it is a little well done on the bottom, unfortunately, but Dan, you tasted it. What did it taste burnt or I wasn't able to gas piece with the cheese. Okay. But you don't really notice that it tastes burnt until you hit the bottom piece. So if you were to eat it upside down, I don't think you'd notice. Okay. Um yeah, I'm gonna try one that's not Oh my gosh. Well, this is think... gonna go. This is gonna I think these are going to go fast. Let me know. What does it taste like? Hmm. Oh, yeah, it's a lot better now that it's not just crescent roll. 
enough cheese, enough pepperoni. Yeah. We don't need more. No, that's actually a really good mix. Okay, perfect. Mm. Look who got home just in time to help. Who? Santa? No, you! Oh, me? Yeah. I got home just in time to give my wife a hand. That's right. And I rushed. All right, so... <clears throat> here's... Here's our tree. I told you guys I'd show you closer. Oh, yeah, we have one day on Stop going. So, let's um, see. Wait. We've got a... Uh, Let's see, which ship is that? Uh, that one's the Disney Dream. That one's the Carnival Pride hiding in there. We've got some Mickey. Dumb question, but is there meant to be a tennis ball in we've the got, No, we've That's got... That's me! Uh, did we ever find uh, you now? NASA. No. I, I, in the wall. I texted in the you wall? about it. That's from NASA. That one's from Fort McHenry. Um, There's Olaf. There. Hello, Olaf. There's Winnie the Pooh. <laughs> um, where is the? No, we know somewhere. Where's the Mickey? Oh, there he is. Okay, so from our tree and one stocking wall. That's another stocking wall over there. Um, we have our mirror that we decorated real pretty. I did most of it. And you did actually. And we've got our, uh, as you can see in the mirror there. Our Mickeys are going on the wall, so let's she did that. She turn that around. So we got we got Mickey going. It's pretty awesome. And then over here are the kids' stockings above the couch. Yeah. And our crazy makeshift tree that we don't even know why we did that. We did try that on the um, tree. And we don't drink, so we can't blame it on that. Yeah, we weren't drunk or anything, so... And then I have a partial little kind of display here. Well, it's a full display, but um, <coughs> this one, the light burnout, and I keep forgetting to pick up a new light bulb for it. And then over here, I forgot, I've got this one going on here. Yeah. So pretty. And then our doorway area here that we did you guys saw that before and then out here we've turned our table and my little tree the dark side? yes we turned our table to the dark side okay i forgot to put this on there we go uh oh you better keep lighting Okay, it's got little lights and I don't think it showed up. And I think I've showed you guys this tree relatively close before. But there you go. Um, and then we've got this area. I don't think that I showed you guys that we put the little ornaments on the swag. Or the, the garland, rather. Um, this, my aunt... And uncle made years and years and years and years ago, and it was my mom. So when she passed, I got to keep that. And we put candy canes up there and there. And one more thing we did. We put um, snowflakes on our window, which is a little difficult to see right now. But they are blue and purple, and I don't think that the colors are showing. But it's cool. It was something to do. Oh, and then we did a stocking there and a stocking there. And here I am back to my sausage. Bye. Okay, you're going to help with the sausage, dear? See? I if, helped. If I did that, 
They'd be everywhere. Well, I used to be a cook. <laughs> Sausage you must flip. Okay, so real quick, I'm just going to show you um, our finished products real quick. So we have the sausages, we have the peppers and onions, the taco soup, which is sort of taco stew-ish. We're going to have chips to dip that in. We've got some cheese there. We also have sour cream. And over here is the uh, pepperoni bread that we made. Here is the cranberry muffins. The meat to balls. And the rolls are not here yet. Um, but here's the, the chips for the, um, the taco soup. Anyway, um, I'm going to drink some coffee and wait. Um, my brother, Brian, is here, um, but my in-laws are not here yet. So um, we're just sort of waiting on them, and they have the rolls. So, yeah, like, we can't really eat without them anyway. <laughs> that was kind of smart. Okay, so this is our after-dinner setup. We've got cheese and crackers. we got some dip, chips cookies, and um, my pistachio pudding salad that I made earlier. And my mother-in-law brought, uh, what is it called, pecan bark? Yeah, pecan, pecan bark. And That's it is good. so good. Addicting. It's, it's very addicting. I've never I'm had it before. I'm about ready to have some more. Hey, guys. So it is 10 o'clock. Um, all of our guests left um, about an hour-ish ago. Mm -hmm. Um so there's a very little cleanup to do, which I'm very pleased with. Um, John and I still have gifts mm -hmm. to wrap, so we're going to be working on that here very soon. Right, of course, yeah. Um, but I yeah, our fun. Christmas oh, Eve get together with family was very good. It was a lot of fun. We played Trivial Pursuit and we had an absolute blast. Um, my brother won because he's a big smarty pants and I was a big fat loser. I don't like that, but it's okay. It was so much fun and uh, looking forward to tomorrow morning. But right now I got to get things together to, um, <laughs> excuse me. I got to get our stuff together to start wrapping. So I got to go gather up the, the tape and the scissors and, um, the wrapping paper and organize the gifts and figure out what needs to go in a box and what doesn't and all that stuff. So, um, I'm going to go start getting ready for that. So it begins, dear. <laughs> Whatever. Um, so we have all the children separated into piles. Now we just got to figure out how to wrap it. Paul's is over there on the floor, which you can't see right now. But I can see it. It's right there. So, yeah. And we have more things over there on the floor, too, that, yeah. So we just got to figure out uh, if things need boxes and that kind of stuff. But we're getting there. We're getting there. We'll be we'll be unrolling and cutting paper soon.
So we took a little break from wrapping, and I came in the living room to find this. She, she's used to being down here alone in the middle of the night, and she's just chilling. Yes, yeah, she is. Yeah, she said, you're disturbing my beauty rest. Yeah, you're disturbing my beauty rest. But the tails are going. Yeah. Are you sleepy, girl? You're, you're trying to get your beauty rest. Huh? You're trying to get that beauty rest, huh? Yeah. She says, Mom, just leave me alone. I'm tired. It was a long day. I'm so tired. Yeah. Okay, so here's part of what we've got so far. And there's some over there, too. But this is Wrapping Central. We'll be done pretty soon, maybe. Hey dear, what do you do when you don't have a box and you need a box? <laughs> <laughs> you're gonna give that to the dog. You get you get a container. That's the pup's Christmas present, but don't tell her. Good morning and Merry Christmas. Um John is out uh getting JJ right now, and um a couple of the kids are still asleep upstairs. Um, it's almost 10 o'clock in the morning. Um, I didn't get to sleep until three. I, I was done wrapping by like one thirty, Um, but I just, I can't always go to sleep right away. So, um, I did some editing of what I, uh, filmed yesterday and, uh, decided to continue it this morning. And, um, I'm going to go make my coffee now. Merry Christmas, dear. Merry Christmas, baby. So we're getting ready to distribute our gifts. Yes. Um, let's just say hello to the children real quick. What up, children? Everybody say Merry Christmas to our viewers. Merry Christmas, everyone! Merry Christmas and have a Happy New Year! Oh. Oh, no, oh. She's a crawler. Yeah. Look at her crawling. <laughs> She's a crawler. You're silly. She's so silly. All right, is everybody ready for some gifts? Yes! Yeah. Yo! All right, let's do it. So we've had our Christmas. How was we, your Christmas? It was awesome. Yeah. Got all kinds of stuff. And uh, it's 12 o'clock, and in a half an hour, we are going out to the movies. We are going to go see uh, Rise of Skywalker. Star Wars! Um, but we'll talk about that in probably our next podcast uh, with Dan and I, so... Um, this is going to end our Christmas Eve and Christmas vlog. So Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas, everyone, and a Happy New Year. To all of you guys from all of us at Spencer's Ventures. Um, we are Spencer's Ventures, and we're going to see you next time, and we're out of here. Bye. Bye.